Hello everyone and welcome back to Desi Plaza TV, another segment of a beautiful, beautiful Sinchin. And uh, we have really uh, had a great success of a Dallas Star Kalakar just now. We finished our semifinals in the, just like uh, any rea other re reality show. It was a great success and uh, we definitely would like to give a little wrap up and you know about all the event and how did it go and all the other things i'm very sure all the viewers are very excited to hear about it so it's a great pleasure for me today to introduce sinchan again here she's not new to dallas anymore <laughs> <laughs> and it's definitely a great pleasure to have her here in the studio one more time thank you for coming sinchan welcome thank you thank you anu and thank you dallas star kalakar it is it's an honor to be part of this wonderful reality show. It's uh, definitely, I mean, if you had attended the semifinals and uh, we could definitely tell the talents that we have in this Dallas-Fort Worth area is amazing. And uh, it was definitely a speechless experience for all of us. And uh, definitely, you know, we could only imagine how much effort sure. they had put in to bring the show to such a great success. So let us uh, begin our show okay. with a little introduction. So how do you feel that as a judge here that, you know, coming and, uh, you know, this, this is an honor for us for sure. So what is uh, your just a little words for participants as a judge? Actually, when I was approached uh, for this wonderful Dallas Star Kalakar uh, to, you know, grace it as a judge, I was very excited because uh, it's always a pleasure judging new talents because we learn a lot of things from them. Mm -hmm. It is just not that we come and judge them. We also get to learn a lot of things uh, from the contestants mm -hmm. and learning from somebody who is staying away from, you know, mm -hmm. India and they uh, singing um, Hindi or, you know, Indian languages song. Mm -hmm. It is really an excitement to come and judge and I was very happy with the uh, turnout and uh, you know the kind of participants uh, mm -hmm. uh, you guys brought uh, to this level actually mm -hmm. I'm really happy about the whole set of contestants this is really wonderful to hear that because uh, like I said you know any other Dallas Star Ka you know reality show Dallas Star Kalakar was a huge huge success and we had a yeah. great turnout absolutely and uh, one thing that I had to ask you in your you know uh, position is it's always very difficult mm -hmm. to decide which contestant is better than any other contestant. It's a very difficult decision for a judge to know sure. yeah. because everyone has a different level of talents and every kid who actually moved to the next round is extremely, extremely talented. Sure. So how difficult it is for a judge to decide and what is your suggestion that for a participant mm -hmm. in order to move to the next round in, you know, just crossing that line, limit line for a judge's, you know, decisions. I know it's like, uh, see, music is very vast. There mm -hmm. are 100 types of uh, genre in music. Sure. So it's like all five fingers are different. Yes. But put together, it becomes a hand. Very strength. So mm -hmm. in music, you need all kinds of uh, singers. You need all kinds of music. Just by singing classical, you can't survive or just by doing, mm -hmm. you know, non-filming, you can't survive. Mm -hmm. So, uh, to decide in such a vast, uh, you know, um, genre okay. of music, it's very difficult because um, it's all about that day's performance, it's all about that day's preparation, that day's focus. And most important, uh, even if they sing very well, mm -hmm. if they cannot connect to the audience, you know, there goes uh, the hard work in vain. Sure. Then you have to improve on the connect. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's, I think it's all about concentration also. Mm -hmm. And um, it's very difficult to say, okay, this is the person who's the winner. If you actually observe in the series of reality shows, mm -hmm. uh, all these contestants are quite repetitive. Absolutely. For example, they might be singing in this particular uh, reality show. Tomorrow you'll see them perform in some other reality show because mm -hmm. the opportunities are very huge mm -hmm. in India. Mm -hmm. But Someday if uh, talent A is a winner here, in the next reality show, talent B is the winner. Sure. So it's all about that day's performance and you know, uh, and how much they're able to connect with themselves. Because yeah. I always tell uh, everybody when they ask me, what is a tip uh, mm -hmm. to participate? Mm -hmm. I say, don't uh, sing to impress others. Mm -hmm. Sing to impress yourself and mm -hmm. sing to impress the talent 
you've been gifted by god absolutely so it's very important um, uh, it's like very important that they are grateful to this whole opportunity mm -hmm. and in a place like dallas uh, you know the star kalakar happening with such amazing uh, mm -hmm. support i mean like i think desi plaza tv is doing a fantastic job Thank by uh, not only doing a reality show but bringing them to the world mm -hmm. because now the social networking site is like so globally connected it's it's like one effort here the whole world comes to know sure. so i think uh, even i myself i feel very lucky to be part of this uh, wonderful uh, episode of uh, dallas star kalakar and uh, the contestants choosing them was definitely a very difficult job because everybody wants to be a winner sure. nobody is happy to lose so the fight amongst uh, you know winners is something uh, <laughs> which is very challenging for the judges what you said is very true sing with your heart and also so because you are singing for yourself yeah. not for pleasing others or just to show that okay you have a talent yeah. when it comes from your heart i think it definitely absolutely you know going to be the best yeah effort that you can ever you know have and also give it to the audience absolutely. and uh, and another thing that you said is completely true because being thousands of miles away yeah. we feel through this one we feel the connection yeah to our culture to our music and also you know especially when kids really go through that mm -hmm. and the parents will feel so proud yeah. and it definitely gives them you know so much of a pleasure that th their kid is at least you know connecting with something some that some is so roots back some home. roots yeah. back home with and, the so and closeness. what i liked a lot uh, is like yeah the as you were telling the parents uh, energy <laughs> in the competition they were so excited to see their kids perform uh -huh. and you know they've made sure that they dress up indian mm -hmm. and you know even the jhumkas are matching the bindis <laughs> are matching so it's all about that entire presentation which they were Absolutely. working on and and i think here i would like to give credit to your entire team because you guys put up that value to this wonderful reality show they have taken it in that sense and it it's always the participants and the listeners or the viewers or the audience who actually mm -hmm. uh, put value to it sure even if you say okay this is the biggest show if people don't turn up what can you do but mm -hmm. the amount of response you had showed yes. uh, you know how big this whole oh. movement is becoming mm -hmm. and it's a wonderful uh, thing mm -hmm. that is really great compliment sanchan and thank you for giving us such an encouraging words it definitely you. means a lot to us because this is a first venture from dallas i mean dp tv okay desi plaza tv to okay. uh, bring up this reality show okay. and uh, the effort behind it will is definitely worth it when we see that you know the happiness and the enthusiasm True. and all those you know the winning pleasure on those kids eyes absolutely. it definitely makes you feel that it's all worth it absolutely so and uh, like you also mentioned i want you to just to comment a little bit i know every participant wants to win mm -hmm. and uh, that is definitely not the reality yeah someone has <laughs> That's to the harsh reality, <laughs> harsh reality. <laughs> yeah. so somebody has to lose and somebody has to win mm -hmm. so how important it is to win and what is your advice like for you know the participants who could not make it to the next round but they definitely have to just you know come and do it again and again see it's like if they have reached this level they have 100% potential mm -hmm. there is no second word about it right. see as i said when somebody becomes a winner they have to be thankful to the losers because <laughs> of their poor performance they flourished okay so it's always a game of uh you know that day that performance we always compare uh, mm -hmm. winning and losing to cricket right because if you take the world's best batsman sachin tendulkar is like yeah. number 1 yes. but rahul dravid is no less <laughs> it's like Equally. yes it was unfortunate that sachin and rahul dravid came in the same era and people definitely compare okay uh, sachin is younger to dravid so compared to him he is performing well right. so it's always you know uh, there is some factor which brings them uh to the next level there mm -hmm. is an x factor which keeps every wow factor about sure so i think in this whole uh, talent hunt and this whole journey of talent hunts what i have experienced is becoming a winner is definitely the most important part of life mm -hmm. but after winning how consistent you are that actually defines your success so i have been a winner of saregamapa also sure. i have been a runner up also mm -hmm. but how consistent i am after becoming a winner and how consistent i am uh, you know after 
uh, getting so many opportunities, that's what defines my uh, graph. Mm -hmm. So people are very um, eager. Today's uh, world, the memory is very low. Mm -hmm. So they want things to you know happen in fraction of a second. It's a, a T20 zamana. Sure. So they want things to be faster. faster. They want success faster. But uh, talent is something, in especially in our performing field, uh, it's you can't say okay I read for 24 hours and I मैंने by heart किया books को chapter को I learnt it by heart and I wrote the exam it's not going to happen that way because your voice or if you're it's a dance or if it's painting or if it's sport I think it's that day which matters so becoming a winner is definitely important but most important is after you're becoming you know the best in the lot what next so becoming a winner is definitely required. <laughs> definitely required, but don't get discouraged yeah. because it did not happen, because it is just giving you a signal that Absolutely. you need more effort. So Absolutely. just keep doing it and you know that will give you more potential next time to yes. come even much stronger. Yeah. So yeah, this is really a great uh, you know experience for all of us and having you here is definitely something that you know we are enjoying it thoroughly <laughs> Thank you. and getting the lot of you know so um, let's take a little short break and then we'll come back and continue with our uh, conversation and we'll talk about you know the presentation of the performance about participants Absolutely. we'll be right back